Welcome back. A healthy, joyful mind and body begins with confidence in our feminine hygiene. Celebrate it, embrace it, and let it shine. Our beautiful friend Ayanda Tebete joined the team for the Face of Gynagar 2024 competition launch as they gave another lucky woman the chance to join their team. Let's take a look. to unveil the latest and most exciting chapter in our journey towards woman confidence and wellness. Today we join the ladies for the launch of the Face of Gynagod 2024 competition and you are VIP guest. Come along. Zizi, for what are some of the characteristics you're looking for in your brand ambassadors and how does that embody the values of Gynagod? We're looking for a powerful woman, a woman who has self-confidence and will be able to empower others and instill the feminine hygiene, more so the intimate care knowledge to other women, empowering them, making sure that they're able to take care of themselves throughout their daily lives and throughout their stages with Gynagod. We've got products that cater for all women throughout their life stages and we out there talking the topics that no one wants to talk about. What are some of the brand's goals and hopes of outcomes with a powerful campaign like this? As the leading brand in feminine hygiene intimate care in South Africa, we're not just looking for a powerful woman, but we're also such a powerful brand that's about empowering women and making sure that we also instill confidence. So we're hoping that the campaign is just going to do that. Make women be able to free to just be, to be able to talk about their feminine hygiene, more so about the intimate issues that they're dealing with and making sure that they take the knowledge that they have to the other women and building a community of self-confident women for South Africa. How does a campaign this big align with the company's morals and of course where your company needs to go next? We want to ensure that we speak to different women in their different life stages and be able to reach them wherever they are in different parts of the country. So we're not only speaking to a certain group of ladies or women, but we're speaking to everyone, literally from teens all the way to menopausal ladies. It is time to celebrate the diverse stories and experiences of women from different walks of life. Let's find out about this incredible opportunity together. Shingiwe, how has being in this role affected your life personally and professionally? I really enjoyed being a guy and a girl because it's helped me to amplify my voice when it comes to spreading the word and empowering young girls and women about feminine hygiene and wellness. Just seeing the difference that I'm able to make together with this brand has been so impactful, not only for me, but for those around me. Some of the initiatives that we've been part of, they've been able to address a lot of misconceptions, um, a lot of stigma around the feminine hygiene and wellness space. So it's been life changing and I like how now people are more open minded and uh, people are able to engage and, you know, address these issues and help us um, change the world one day at a time. I think it's very important for men to take part in these initiatives because first we need to remember that women are our rocks, women are powerful and I think it also breaks the whole gender inequalities and also gives women also the ability to be leaders in their respective fields so I think that's one of the things that I think is very important for us to support our women. I think femininity as a whole was a big topic today and I really appreciated that, you know, especially because it's not spoken about that much, especially on social media, so that it's becoming more of a norm is a great thing. At face value, yes, it's a campaign where you're trying to find these amazing women, but when you scratch a little bit deeper, I think there's two powerful things that you really get, right? I think at one level, it's really about this demystifying the stigmas, the, the, the taboos around feminine hygiene. On a second level, it's about women empowerment, right? And I think that whilst information is empowering, we've already found three people who are adding a fourth person to this. These are people whose lives are going to be impacted by the whole campaign, but they will also impact lives in return. So I think that it's important that we create platforms like this that in the end lead to like real impact for young South Africans out there as well. 
that is what I call dedication to health, empowerment and care. Here's to a future of confidence, care and the celebration of women. What an exciting competition. Would you like to join the Guy Nagar team? Well, here is how you can join the ranks of women who show support and love in abundance. Are you the one? Gynagard, South Africa's number one brand in feminine hygiene intimate care, is searching for the next face of Gynagard. You could win a Fiat 500 and 100,000 Rand in prizes and so much more. To enter, all you have to do is buy any Gynagard intimate wash and visit www.faceofgynagard.co.za. Competition ends 31st of October, so enter now and claim your chance to be the one. T's and C's apply.